Hey, welcome to SOBC TV and your host, Will Young. Today we have Tristan Holmes, uh, freshman kid going over into North Medford High School, certainly one of the top players in the Southern Oregon Basketball Club. As an eighth grader, was a starting point guard on our ninth grade team. So certainly we expect uh, a lot of great things from him. He's a great athlete. Hey, listen, we've been doing this now for about six months through the basketball club and now the, uh, the Summer Basketball Academy. What do you think? You know, uh, do you think that has improved your game? How do you feel about your game right now? Yeah, I feel like I'm a lot better at shooting and dribbling. It just helped me a lot. Just get back to my rhythm. Well, listen, what, what, what do you think now? I know, I know um, when I mentioned you was a pretty good shooter, I think you, you've improved that area. But what do you think are the things that you really needed to work on to become a better basketball player? First of all, catching and shooting the ball. And like refining my dribbling and just working on my defense. Well, that catch and shoot is pretty big for the Southern Oregon Basketball Club because we want kids to be able to shoot that basketball. We don't want them holding it. We want them to be able to, to shoot the basketball. Hey, listen, I thought hey, that your spring, I thought it was tremendous. I think I think um, the, even though mistakes are made, that's what that's part of your growth. I thought you recovered very well. Uh, certainly, we went with the Reno. You were major out there. What do you think the highlights was of the, the basketball travels this spring? Well, I, I, I got to tell you, I was very happy, uh, and you know I'm going to be on you hard all the time, but I was very happy with the, with the progress. Um, the, you know, there's going to be a bittersweet time come next spring. I don't I don't see you playing on our team next next spring. Uh, if all goes well, I think you'll get a chance to play on that team ICP up in Portland or another team that will get to travel a little bit more than we do. Um, I just want, we, but we are going to continue to uh, to build and work together. You've been a very positive uh, influence on what we're doing. A great kid. We have great kids in here. What, what's next for you? I know you got football coming up, but what's next for you? How far do you think you can take this basketball situation? Well, just, right now, I just want to make the varsity work that for basketball. So I'm just going to keep on working. All right, what are your motivating factors? I know there's always, I know I try to motivate my own kids personally and certainly the kids in our, in our program. What is What motivates you the most? Trying to prove other people wrong. Show what you can do to other people. Well, as you can see, people, this, this you know, he's a, he's a uh, soft-spoken, kind-hearted, honest, uh, again, you can't be, you can't find better kids than these out there. We wish you all the best. Um, hey, if things don't work out at uh, ICP, like, yeah, we know you're gonna make the team, but if you want to do something else, can, can we can we uh can we get the uh, the second round draft pick? Can we can you bring we bring you back? Oh yeah, definitely. Well, definitely. But listen, again, one of our one of our top players in the program. We look for big things from him in the future. And if you want to know more about uh, uh, about Tristan and certainly about any any young person in the Southern Oregon Basketball Club, you can go to Southern Oregon Basketball Club. Squarespace.com, and you'll know you'll you can for profiles and other scheduling information. But until then, we want to say goodbye to Chris. I mean, about Tristan, and uh, and and again, we hope that he has a successful career. Take care, sir.